Hi, I'm Patricia and this is Carla and we're here from the Bedford Public Library with some tips and techniques to help you use the library online. Today we're going to be talking about IndieFlix, which is a great website that allows you to stream all kinds of independent films, classic TV, foreign films and documentaries. So let's go ahead and dive in. Carla, take it away. <laughs> So we're gonna start by going to the library website, which is bedfordnhlibrary.org. And then we're gonna navigate over to the e-library tab on the right side of the screen and click on databases A to Z. Once here, all the databases are in alphabetical order. So we're gonna go ahead and scroll down until we find IndieFlix. Once you click on the link, it's going to bring you out to the Recorded Books or RB Digital website. You'll notice here there's two different uh, services listed, Great Courses and IndieFlix. We're just going to talk about IndieFlix today, uh, but go ahead and check out our other videos for information on Great Courses. So once you click on IndieFlix, it brings up this screen with the big red checkout button. And so if you go ahead and click on that, it's going to check out a seven day pass that allows you to view all the content. If you don't already have an RB Digital account, uh, either for IndieFlix or Great Courses, you can register on this pop up window right here at the bottom of the screen. You'll just fill out all this information that they've asked for and hit register. We already have an account, so we're just going to go ahead and sign in. So just to clarify, you're signing in with the account you created here, not with your library card information. So once we sign out, it gives us a confirmation and we can go ahead and access. Okay. So now we're on the IndieFlix website. Um, and we'll go ahead and X out of that. So you can go ahead and at the top of the screen, there's a search button, and you can use that to search for a specific title if you're looking for a particular movie or TV show. So, or you can just scroll down through the IndieFlix list to browse by uh, curated lists of videos or to look at specific genres. Once you find a movie you like, uh, and we'll, we'll look at Ozzie and Harriet maybe, <laughs> Once you find a movie you like, just click on it to bring it up, and that should allow you to just start playing the video or watch a trailer if you're not sure. So easy enough to start streaming all kinds of movies and TV from home. So uh, thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoy watching some great movies, and please feel free to check out our other tips and techniques below. Thanks.